Ow, why do you do, why, why are you the way you are? Why are you the way that you are? All right, we've been squatting for six weeks, five weeks, we may have skipped a week, but today is max out Friday. You have yet? <laughs> We're just building up to a max, see how heavy we can get. All right, we finished the general warm up. I do the same general warm up every day, which is hip circle and crossover symmetry. Her general warm up is running around, doing nonsense, standing in front of a heater, chasing a dog. Am I wrong? <laughs> You're wrong. I did squats and band and. She squat? squatted down to tie her shoes, basically. Now we're gonna move into the specific warm up, which is basically just working up our squat. And then we're gonna try and PR our squat today. Um, my best is 280, which is really bad. And your best is 200? Um, Pre-pregnancy or post-pregnancy? Pre-post. Post 200. Okay, so we're trying to set a new post-pregnancy PR for her and just a PR PR for me. Let's see how it goes. What did you just hit there? 205. What are you going for next? 215. This is pre-pregnancy PR, so lifetime, pre lifetime PR we're going for right here. Two misses, but we're staying positive. 205, post-pregnancy PR. Yeah. And 10 pounds short of a lifetime PR, which we will hit. And I'm. Four or five weeks, easy. Three pounds, four, almost four pounds, less than what I weighed when I hit my original PR. There you go. I'm about to do 275, which is five pounds short of a PR for me, but I'm trying to set myself up for two sets from now, so we'll see. All right, I've done 20 pound jumps all the way up. Just did 275, felt pretty easy. I'm gonna stick with the 20 pound jump and shoot for 295. And then if that feels good, I'd love to get into the 300s, but we'll see. So easy. Nice. All right, 295 went well, so we're sneaking five more pounds on just to get to that 300 pound mark. You boop the baby. Boop. <laughs> boop. You boop the baby. Yeah! You work, babe. You did it! You happy? I said, do you want to hear a cool song? No, it's not even about... Sweet potatoes, ba ba ba. They're like regular potatoes, but sweeter. Nobody's gonna think it's funny. Nobody. <laughs> Why are you the way you are? Sweet potato. It's like regular potatoes, but maybe a better source of carbohydrates post workout. Hosea, what are you eating? Butternut squash. Sweet potatoes. Ba, ba, ba. Not everyone knows musical genius when they see it. 
I imagine some people treated the Beatles like this. Michael Jackson. Garth Brooks. <laughs> Alright, I, I may or may not have, but definitely did just take an hour nap. Alright, 21, 15, 9, devil press, jumping lunges, jumping squats, rip me. I imagine the devil press is going to take about half the workout and the other two movements are probably going to be half as well. Uh, we're going to see how fast we can get through this. I have no clue how long it's going to take, but I think it's going to be really hard. Twelve forty-three. like I expected, the devil press was the majority of the workout. It was more than I expected even. It was two thirds of the workout rather than just half. The fifties for something like devil press is really heavy. Essentially doing the upward phase of a burpee with an extra 100 pounds body weight. It's no joke, successful day. PR'd the back squat, got in a really nasty workout. You go to the gym and you work hard, but especially in a regular gym, you don't see people on the floor gasping for air a whole lot. It's part of fitness a lot of people are missing. <laughs> 